Welcome back. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how you can map an image to your model in order to create transparency on your model. On my screen here, I've got a red square. It's 72 pixels by 72. Now you may notice that in the bottom right corner is a dot. That's one pixel in size. And this red color matches the red of the main square. So what's going to happen is that Inventor will recognize the color of that pixel and remove from the main image all the pixels of the same color. And this makes the image transparent. This is kind of hard to understand when I explain it, but once you see it in action, it's going to make sense. Currently, the image I'm looking at is entitled C ampersymbol.gif. I've got another image as well, A ampersymbol.gif. Let's take a look at that one. So this one is also a red square, but there's no tiny red square in the bottom corner. As you may have noticed, both of my images had the amper symbol in their title. In order for your image to work as a transparent image, you have to include the amper symbol in the name. The amper symbol is also known as the AND symbol. It's Shift F7 on the North American keyboard. Let's open the Appearance browser, and I'll add a new generic appearance. Okay, click the image field. Let's select the image with the red dot in the bottom right corner, that's C amper symbol, and click open. Now double click in the image field to open the texture editor. Under scale, let's change the sample size, one inch by one inch. Close the texture editor. Let's apply and cancel out. Now let's select this face. Right click on my appearance, assign to selection. Let's close the browser. As you can see, we do have transparency on my model now, but to better see it, let's render the image with Inventor Studio. Render image. For scene style, I'll use something bright and bold like Galaxy. And click Render. And here is our transparency. Let's close, finish Inventor Studio. Back to the Appearance Browser. Let's edit this appearance now. I'm going to use one of my other images. I'm going to select cc.gif. It's the exact same image, but it doesn't have the amper symbol in the name. As you can see just from the preview, we don't have transparency. All right, let's edit that appearance again. We're going to change the image. Here's my third image. A amper symbol dot gif. The only difference is that it doesn't have the red pixel in the bottom white corner. However, there is a white pixel. Let's select it. And as you see in the preview, the transparency is inverted. This concludes our tutorial about using an image map to create transparency on your model.